A live look this evening at Division Street between I-90 and Sprague. You may want to avoid this section of road for the next week or so, or at least give yourself some extra time if this is normal for you. Look at that backup. Division Street is down to one lane up to Sprague Avenue until 7 at night, and that goes for a while. Railroad crews are repairing the rail overpass after a crash last month. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kirsten O'Connor. And I'm Aaron Luna. As you can imagine, it kind of got my heart going just looking at all that traffic. The lane closures are causing a major headache for drivers. Vanessa Perez live downtown with how you can prepare Vanessa. Well, traffic is just backed up here, as you can see on Division. You want to leave your house early or take an alternate route to avoid all of this. A mom we spoke to earlier says it typically takes her five minutes to get her son to daycare. That is now bumped up to 20 minutes with these repairs going on. Backed up traffic during primetime commute. Sierra works at the gas station right in the middle of the chaos. She uses Division to get her son to daycare before work every morning. I don't get that, him there by a specific time. He's unable to go to daycare. So it's pretty frustrating to, to have this going on and not being able to get him there on time. I almost wasn't able to get him in today, which was kind of frustrating. This will be the norm for the next nine days as crews make repairs to this railroad overpass. Washington State Department of Transportation says your best alternate route is to exit on Hamilton or Broadway. That afternoon, you know, 4.30 to 6 o'clock commute, we could see some delays and some, some backups on Interstate 90. For some, driving down Division is already a rough time. This adds another headache for drivers. It is a nightmare. Once you get past, further down Ruby, it gets easier. But right here at the beginning, because people are coming off spray, coming this way, and unfortunately going this way as well, they're, not, they're turning where they're not supposed to be turning. As Division is down to one lane, people like Sierra are adjusting schedules. As long as this, going, this is going on, I'll probably have to leave early just to make it to work on time or make it to the daycare on time and then get to work on time. And this project is expected to wrap up in nine days. Division Street will be completely open after 7 p.m., but you'll definitely want to give yourself a little extra time leaving the house or take an alternate route. Live in Spokane, Vanessa Perez, 4 News Now. Vanessa, thank you.